beloved people, the Lord Jehovah has spoken with me at this hour. And I see that the Lord takes me to a place. And as I go to that place, I'm walking with a group of bishops to that place. And then all of a sudden, enormous amount of power leaves from me and raptures open a tomb. And then when the tomb raptures open, one that was dead and buried there raises their left hand like this and says, hey, I'm here, help me, and does the hand like this. Hey, help me. Does the hand like this. Help me, I'm here. Help me. From under the tomb. And all the bishops run away. Everybody flee away. Then I began to dig this person out of the tomb that raptured. And walked away with this person. But the rest ran away, did not come back. The Bible speaks about the latter glory and the latter anointing. And it says that the latter glory of this house, the latter wine that was prepared from water without fermentation would be a stronger wine. And in the book of John chapter 2 verses 1 to 11, when Jesus converted water into wine, the chief guest of the banquet, he asked, and he said, most people bring out their choicest wine first and share it with the guests. And then they bring out the cheaper wine later. But for you, you have kept back the choicest wine and only released it at the end. In this land, we have seen the resurrection of the dead decomposing corpse called Mama Rosa. Stinky and smelly that the Lord sent me to resurrect, to speak about the hour and the coming of the Messiah, the coming of the King. They need to prepare the way in urgency, with urgency, in a timely manner. And then now, he's speaking about the rapturing of a tomb and the resurrection because I saw the grass on top of the tomb and the resurrection, the tomb raptures and the resurrection of somebody that was buried. The wonders of this time. And raises the hand, left hand and says, I'm here, please help me. And does the, from the palm like this, does like this, the, the, from the ground, from the soil. It's a wonder, it's terrifying, it's very spooky. All the bishops I was with, everybody ran away from me. And I went there and pulled the person out of the tomb. It reminds me of another conversation when the Lord took me to the graveyards. And somebody resurrected from the tomb. And when I walked there, he that was speaking with me was standing there. As I walked into the graveyard, a lot of power left me. There were many tombs. And then somebody resurrected from the tomb. And he that had come from heaven, that was standing there and speaking with me, when I reached there, I asked him, where did he come from? He's a man, this one around, this time around. And he told me the second tomb. So when I looked at the second tomb, I saw that it had been raptured open. When I looked this way, he that spoke with me had disappeared, had left. But the person that was resurrected, as I walked into the graveyard, because of the narrow way, he came quickly and he passed me and he walked like this. He was walking like this. He walked away like that. As he passed by me, then I went and asked, from which tomb did he come? Then he said, the second tomb. When I looked at the tomb, it had ruptured open. And so I looked at him going, I said, hey, 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 stop a moment. Can you come here? Then he stopped and he did this. He looked at me like this. Like that. 
in a very spooky manner. And everybody ran away. He looked at me like this. And everybody ran away. You have kept the choicest wine and only brought it out at the end. But most people bring out the choicest wine first and share it and serve it. But you, Jehovah, the tremendous God of Israel, you have kept the choicest wine and only brought it out at the end. The Messiah is coming. Shalom Toda. Toda Haverim. Toda Toda. Toda Haver Sheli. Jehovah Eli. The Messiah is coming. Prepare the way. Thank you.